shell in the Donbas region continues despite the Minsk ceasefire deal. Ukrainian army shells Donetsk, Lugansk and surrounding settlements. As a result of Ukrainian artillery strikes, there are five fire in Donetsk last night. Kyiv appointed governor of the Lugansk region in eastern Ukraine, Gennady Moskal has ordered to dig trenches along the disengagement line between the Kyiv-controlled territories and territories controlled by the self-defense forces of the Lugansk People's Republic. UN General Assembly's Third Committee passed a Russia-proposed resolution condemning attempts to glorify Nazism ideology and denial of German Nazi war crimes. The resolution was passed on Friday by the committee, which is tasked with tackling social and humanitarian issues and human rights abuses, by 115 votes against three. The US, Canada and Ukraine were the countries to vote against it. Germany's FM Frank Walter Steinmeier has said he's against Ukraine joining NATO. In an interview with Der Spiegel, he said he considers that it is possible for NATO to have a partnership with Ukraine, but not membership. Meanwhile, Russia President Vladimir Putin's spokesman Dmitry Peskov said one of the means of changing the balance of power in the world to eventually subdue Russia was NATO's gradual approach towards its borders, which made Russia nervous, he said, speaking to the BBC. Russia needs a 100% guarantee that no one would think about Ukraine joining NATO, Peskov said. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive up-to-date news on situation in Ukraine.